you're going to serve some soup, you got to do it right. Make it a meal. Tina's standing by with the great and powerful Laura McIntosh with more. I love butternut squash. Hi. How are you? And this is such a simple and easy. Make it easy. Make it easy. Because I haven't done it because I think it's too hard. Oh, it's not at all. And here's a couple of tricks. Go to your market and buy your butternut squash already. Oh, Done. That's half the work. Most of the time. Yeah. So this is, again, recipes on our website, bringingithome.com. And I'm going to put it in the stove as well. So I'm going to use the habanero. So oh. in a pot on the stove, you're going to just add the cubes. You're going to cover it in water. You're going to bring it to a boil, then turn it down on low about 20 minutes until the... Um, Butternut squash is like a mashed potato, right? Okay. Nice and this is all you're going to do. You're going to put it in your blender. You're going to add uh, unsweetened coconut milk, a little cumin, a little garlic, a little cinnamon. All goes in the pot. You're going to squeeze a piece of orange. And you're going to add that in there as well. And then, of course, the Indian chilies and the habanero sauce. By the way, I uh, found out that they are available nationwide online. And I have a full bottle here, but literally I've only had this for a week and I'm almost down oh. to the Okay. So okay. I love it. Okay. So a big tablespoon in there. And <laughs> I go, it's really so good. It will change your life, seriously. Okay. So there it is. You blend it. Now, I have saved water from when I boiled the. Um, the squash, yeah. in case you it, add a little bit of the water that you boiled, um, boiled it in. And here it is finished. I did one for you last night. Really. Oh, my delicious. gosh. That looks that delicious. Great? Yeah. Now, you can do a couple of things. You can put a little cilantro on the top if you want, just to make it look pretty. You know, it's, it's, we're going into fall, so that's nice. We also harvested our walnuts. Um, so you can also, I think this goes really nicely, you can shave some walnuts. Oh. Right over the well. And then, of course, if you want to dust it with a little pepper, that works. And last but not least. Look at you all fancy. Uh, and all of this is optional. You, know, you don't have to do anything. It's really done once it's blended. And if you want to float a little olive oil on top, make sure you use really good olive oil and just float a bit around the rim. I mean, now, now this is restaurant style, right? Yeah, okay, fancy. But <laughs> make sure you Olive oil, make sure you get really this is going to these are great for Christmas presents, but this is an arsenal in your kitchen. You're gonna love me. Okay, first. say it again, the name of it. Cien chiles. Cien chiles. C I E N Chilies. Chilies. That's the name of the company? So that's what I'm looking for? Okay. So Cien Chilies, it's habanero. She has the mustard, she has okay. the um jalapeno. And look, I have to show you something. Um, my jalapeno is almost gone. It's so good. I put it on everything I use. It as salad right. dressing. I, you name it, you can use it. I must try. I must try. All right. You can get more information. Bring it home with Laura McIntosh. What's the website? Bring it home. Com? com. And all of the recipes are on the website, Instagram, TikTok. Yeah, yeah, because your daughter does all that. We know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank, thank you. Jordan, back over to you. Good